six, five, four, command engine start, two, one, zero. Ignition. And lift off. left of your screen, the altimeter on the left, excuse me, altimeter on the right and the speedometer on the left. There we go, main engine cutoff confirmed. Passing 200,000 feet. Now with the main engine cutoff, with the BE3 U, excuse me, the BE3 engine turned off, the vehicle continues to climb up towards its apogee, but as you will see on the left side, the speedometer will come down. And once that speedometer hits zero, that's when you know exactly that the vehicle has hit uh, apogee, its highest altitude in, uh, in the flight of the vehicle. Now I understand that separation of the capsule from the booster has been confirmed. And zero G has started for our astronauts. All right, you see the, the, excuse me, the booster that is headed down. You see the drag fins, the drag brakes that have just deployed. Those cut the speed of the booster in half. Also at the top of the rocket there, you see uh, the forward fins. They kind of look like pie slices, one on each quadrant. That helps keep the vehicle stable. And there we go, BE3 engine relight. Landing gear deployed. 50 feet, 8 feet per second. Touch up. Auto sound started. And touchdown. Welcome home, New Shepard. Uh, looks like we do have two parachutes that have full inflation. The third is not quite fully in, uh, inflated. But actually, Jackie, this is. Um, this is part of the design. We, one of the, in fact, the fir, we were talking about my fir, webcast. The first webcast that we did, we actually, we tested a shoot out. There are multiple redundant uh, factors in this, uh, in this system. And so landing with two parachutes is perfectly okay for this system. You'll also see the dust take out of the base of the, uh, of the capsule as she comes in to land. That is the air cushioning system. It's going to kick up a lot of that West Texas dust you just talked about. But it also, there it is, touchdown of the crew capsule. A beautiful flight for our rocket, for our crew capsule, for our six new astronauts, Mason, Sylvain, Ken, Carol, Gopi, and Ed. You are officially astronauts. Welcome home, everybody.